Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Today is about aspartame, one of the most insidious poisons that the Federal Drug Agency in America has approved. Up until 1981, it wasn't approved because of tumours in rat testing and seizures. However, Ronald Reagan, ex-president, got on the board of inquiry. Ronald Reagan authorised a Dr. Hayes to get uh, Arthur Hill, Paul Hayes Jr. approve the use of aspartame after his board said do not approve deadly poison because it contains 10% amethanol which is wood alcohol that's the stuff that sends you blind and then you have the aspartame in your Coca-Cola or your Pepsi at about 30 degrees that's when it free methanol is created inside you when you drink it goes into your stomach mixes with the enzyme chemistry chemotrypsin so it breaks down in your stomach into formic acid and formaldehyde Again, formaldehyde is a poison, it's a neurotoxin, and it kills. Yep, and formic acid used to strip paints. But the recommended consumption is 7.8 milligram a day. Now that's what's in one litre of a Spartamine sweetened beverage. Hello, Mr. Coca-Cola. That contains 56 milligrams slightly higher right. some people consume as much as 250 milligrams they drink a lot of coke or Pepsi and they wonder why they're getting ill anyhow they probably have to do this, this in two parts formaldehyde is a known carcinogen causes retinal damages interferes with DNA replication causes deep birth defects and it's funny enough, they've tested it on animals, but the animals don't accept the spartamine the same as people. There's no human studies to evaluate the mutagenic, the tero, teratogenic or carcinogenic effects of chronic administration of methyl alcohol. That's because everybody's drinking coke. In Desert Storm, the troops have treated to large amounts of aspartame sweetened beverages and it's hot in the Saudi sun and it was heated to over 86 degrees many of them returned home numerous disorder, disorders similar to what's seen in person have been chemically poisoned by formaldehyde now the FDA proved that was 1993 I guess In 96, without notice, all restrictions from aspartame were removed, allowing it to be used in everything, including all heated and baked goods. How do you slim the population down? Give them all Coca Cola or Pepsi or similar soft drinks. Anyhow, we have a few reactions. There's 92 reactions to aspartame and ethanol, or commonly called Coke or Pepsi any drink with Nutrisweetin which is the other name for aspartame that's a friendly name okay reactions abdominal pain, abdominal pain anxiety attacks arthritis asthma asthmatic reactions bloating edema that's fluid retention <coughs> Blood sugar control problems, that's hypo or hyperglycemia. Brain cancer, breathing difficulties, burning eyes or throat, burning urination, you can't think straight. That's like me. Chest pains, chronic cough, chronic fatigue, confusion, death, depression, diarrhea, dizziness excessive thirst or hunger fatigue now excessive thirst or hunger 
is that's water, it's from more of the aspartame. And there is a thing in your body called candida, which loves aspartame. Feel unreal, flushing of the face, baldness or thinning of hair, headaches, migraines, dizziness, hearing loss, heart palpitation, hives, which is urticaria. Now, that is only 30 or so. So, tomorrow we'll go through all the rest and uh, it just doesn't go into those kind of things. It causes Parkinson's, so it's one of the causes. So, we'll do that tomorrow. Or should I do a few more? Do a few more now. Only till we get to memory loss. Right, get hypertension, which is high blood pressure, impotency, and sex problems, inability to concentrate, susceptible to infection, insomnia, irritability, itching, joint pains, laryngitis, thinking in a fog, not personality changes and memory loss. That is where we'll get to today. And tomorrow we'll do the final part on aspartame. So if you think you're enjoying your coke, enjoy it. It can take between one year, five years, 10 years, 20 or 40. Now, if you're lucky, you'll have early symptoms and you'll be able to stop it. Now, some of these can be changed, but not all of them. I think the death, death one can't be changed, but the others, some others can. Anyhow, till tomorrow, have a good day. And as you can see, it's almost sunny. It's the only time of the day when the temperature is nice. And that cloud will go away to about 30 degrees anyway have a great day see you tomorrow bye